Hi, and welcome to It Figures. Tonight, I am going to be reviewing Thrall from World of Warcraft. It is made by DC Unlimited. I've reviewed a few other World of Warcraft figures on here, but this is actually my first premium figure that I have. And as you can see, the figure is much larger than the standard World of Warcraft figure. There's nothing really great about this box uh, besides, you know, just has some photographs on the back and the open sides in front. If you wanted to keep Thrall in the box, it would be okay for collectors, but we're going to open him up. Just a few twisty ties here on the back of the package. Once you get the box off, you have to deal with more twisty ties on the inside of the package. So here he is. The Orc War Chief Thrall. First, let's take a look at this incredible detail here. The DC Direct World of Warcraft figures are just so amazing in the amount of detail that they put into their figures. Let's take a look at the detail in this hammer. It's just absolutely amazing. As you can see, just every rivet, every crack. I mean, they didn't spare any detail in this whatsoever. I mean, you can even see the smallest detail in the handle here. It's just amazing. And you can see his glove and even the back of the hammer is just great. The spiked shoulder pads. And on his other side. Even the back of his armor, which people probably never even would see if he's on a shelf, is just incredible. The back of his belt to his chain mail to all the rivets to the really highly detailed spiked boot up to his shin and knee guards. And even his belt looks amazing from the front. You can even see the strap there holding his boot on. As you can see the detail of Thrall's face. And he has these brilliant blue eyes which is kind of really awesome. And the texture of his skin. As for articulation, Thrall has almost none. Because I really need to point out here that he's not so much a figure than he is a statue. You know, his one hand does turn here. His other hand turns as well. And the hammer actually rotates. But as far as I can tell, you cannot take the hammer out of his hand. It's in there permanently. His right foot does rotate a little bit. Just at the bottom of the knee here. And that's pretty much it for the articulation of Thrall. But like I said, he's more of a statue than a figure to be played with. The only real accessory that comes with Thrall is this really awesome dragon head that he's standing on. And even though this dragon head is just a stand, it's actually more detailed than most figures you can buy. One of the horns on the back of the dragon looks like it was broken off. And again, just a great little detail there. There is a peg for his foot to actually fit on. So his foot doesn't just rest on the dragon. You can actually secure it on there. The paint here is also just absolutely exceptional. There is no overpainting or overspraying that I can see anywhere. Overall, this is just one absolutely amazing figure. You'll be paying anywhere between $25 to $30 for this figure, but if you're a fan of great detail and World of Warcraft, this is a no-brainer. Thrall gets a five out of five.